Alrighty, it's revenge time. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to this 2K23 my career. And we are going up against my former team, the team that drafted me, the Houston Rockets, for the first time this season. And we're going to start off with a bam at a bio layup to start off the game. This is the first matchup of the year at one of two, I believe, against the Houston Rockets. Next game we play against them will be in Houston. This one so happens to be in Miami. The Rockets are fell down to the second seed since I left as Chris Stapps gets the rebound and puts it up. They fell down to the second seed. They've been a um, bit mid since I've left. They've, they're 10 and 10, I mean 5 and 5 in their last 10 as we have just been going off in our last 10. I believe we're on a massive win streak at the moment. Bam out of bio. I'm, you know, I'm going straight into the paint on Jabari Smith, my former rookie teammate. Man's average, I had that man averaging 17 points a game as a rookie. As I'm going to hit these free throws and give us a 4-2 to two lead. And hopefully this game is competitive unlike every other game I've played this year. Because, my God. How is that a foul, bro? Really? Because, my God, every game has been a blowout. Like, we've blown out every team. And this Heat team is not that good. Oh, that should have been a steal! Chris Middleton. Yep. Uh, picking up where he left off last time I played with him. Taking dumb shots and not making them. Cutting back door. That's an easy dunk for my first points of the game. Yeah, because Bam has four, right? Or am I tripping? I don't know if I'm tripping. If all those things went away from my stat sheet, I'd be able to see how many points I have. But they're all just there. How many points? Two? Two? Four. Okay, I did make a shot. Chris Middleton going to kick it out to Kevin Porter Jr. I'm there in time as he's going to miss it. He was It was an open shot, too. He just... Uh, missed time to release. Uh, that was kind of a bad pass. Bam gets blocked by Chris Stapps. All right, well, they have been doing this way too often for my liking. The whole point of having a backup point guard off the bench is so I wouldn't have to play shooting guard. But, I mean, it is what it is, I guess. Even though I end up with the ball anyways. They have Lowry playing point guard with me at shooting guard. It happens way more often than I'd like it to. Because, like I said, the whole point of there being Lowry playing off the bench is so I don't have to play shooting guard. But it is what it is, even though we have every single position. We have a point guard, shooting guard, small forward, power forward, and center coming off the bench. That's just the way we run it, I guess. I had no choice because... Wow, he missed, though. I had no choice but to go help on that Jalen Green because... Knowing 2K, I'd rather leave the open three instead of the drive. And one. I'd rather have the open three instead of the drive, to be honest. Because the open three, they'll most likely miss. All right, now I'm getting subbed out. We have a five-point lead. Both offenses have been doing absolutely nothing, and it's a tie game going into the second quarter. Yeah, we're shooting 35%. They're shooting 38%, dude. It's bad out here. It's bad out here for both offenses. Jimmy, okay, never mind. Don't do nothing. They they have the pick and roll on lockdown, dude. On lockdown. Bam, you caught the... I did not. I thought Jalen Green was going to close out on me. Wow, dude. They have us on lockdown right now. We can't get. Why is KJ Martin wearing number 15 now? Oh, whatever the case is. We cannot get anything going. Nothing going. I can't get any passes in the pick and roll right now. Completely locked down. 24 to 20. I'm going to have to start trying to score on my own instead of trying to get assists. As I get right by. That should be a green. I did not want a jump shot, but I'll take that. I didn't even notice they're running KJ Martin at power forward. So, bam, post up, bro. Come on, post him up. You, you're you asking for me to get a turnover there. Bam, out of bio, and he missed completely. Ay, ay, ay. He was asking. That was 2K baiting me into a turnover with the way he was going. Bam, don't switch. Why would we switch? Why would we switch? There was no need for it. That, that's just 2K being 2K. And now, yep, Chris Middleton gets a wide open dunk. Bro, I swear to you, Chris Stapp has to have at least five blocks right now. Three at minimum. Because this man is blocking every single shot that goes into the, the paint. That is his paint right now. No one is getting anything down there. No one. It is actually crazy. What happened? I wasn't even paying attention. How did he get the steal? Oh my god. Why am I getting switched? Is my question. And how did I not get the steal there? He's knocking that down. How did he get the steal, and how did I not? Why did we switch? There's a lot of questions going on here. Go right by. That should be a foul on Porzingis. That's his first. 
I just checked. Porzingis has six blocks. Six blocks so far in this game. Two and a half minutes left and no one has broke 40 points yet. This is insane. This isn't... How is Jalen... Why am I slowing down when Jalen Green does a dribble move? Why? What is the reason for it? And this man's gonna probably gonna get a stupid steal on me. Luckily, he didn't. I was waiting for it. Uh, Jimmy, that should be an easy point for you. Thank you. One minute left. 36 to 38. I'm just in awe of how low scoring this game is. Just in awe. Just all. I don't even call it all defense. It's just none of our offenses are doing anything. It's all just stagnant. Why? You did you see, bro? Did you see how 2K slowed my character down? Like this is a common issue in this game. They slow your character down. Can I lock on, please? I don't know. I maybe the replay won't show it, but I I I saw that they slowed him down. When Jalen Green got the ball, it's a real thing. 2K literally screws you over in this year's 2K if you're not guarding, face guarding your man. If you're not all over him, they will punish you by just slowing down your character on purpose. It's honestly just sad. And they subbed me out with 25 seconds. I don't, I don't see what the point is. There's 25 seconds left in the game. We're, we're up by it's 40 to 42, the lowest scoring game of the season. This chair, dude. I'm going to lose my mind with this goddamn chair. Why? I don't know why it just sinks down. Start of the third quarter. 40 to 42 is the score. Four assists to four turnovers. Not good. Not good at all. Two of those uh, turnovers are complete bogus. Because... They oh, wow. I did not see him cutting back door. Two of those turnovers are bogus because they were just steals that... I don't understand how they were steals. I was just standing there and I lose the ball. Like, 2K just wants to screw me over tonight, huh? And, bro... They have the screens on lockdown. I can't get no assist on screen. Bam! You have a point guard on you. Oh, my Lord. I, I can't tonight with my players. Bam, you have a point guard on you, and you force the ball right back to me for some reason. Man, I'm going to try this one more goddamn time, dude. If you can't score here, you're not going to be able to. You're not going to be able to because Jimmy Butler just went directly into your driving lane as I hit the three. Directly into it. Bro, I want I just want to see real quick the shooting splits of my teammates. Bam's three for eight. Uh Old Depot's one for three. Butler's one for six. Omir Yurtsevin's 0 for 1. 0 for 2, 0 for 3, 0 for 1. The only person helping me is Kyle Lowry, and he's bar I've barely played with him. Th this is insanity, dude. Actually, it's actually crazy how my teammates just aren't able to score the ball right now. No matter where they are on the court. They cannot get a bucket to fall. Also, what a terrible pass, man. Bam, please, for the love of God. At least, yeah, at least get to the line. I have not had a game this season so far with less... They called a timeout. I have not had a game this season with less than 10 assists so far, and I'm not letting that happen now. I don't care how many turnovers I get. I am getting my 10 assists no matter what. And if I don't, I'm going to be pissed. I thought he passed that. This, this is more than five seconds, 2K. That, that's more than five seconds. Jalen Green with the ball. He's probably going to score here, to be brutally honest with you. He's Victor Oladipo on him. Screen. Oh, that's a three. That's a miss, though. Bam, give it out to me. I don't know why I pulled that. I didn't want... I wanted a three, but... 2K, 2K knows... Why every time you want to switch... Just let, I can get, I have time to get to my man. We don't, wow, he airballed the hell out of that. And Bam couldn't even grab the rebound. That's how bad he airballed that. But bro, I have time to get to my man. 2K just immediately goes, switch, switch. Victor, please score. Well, was there, was there a reason why you passed it to me? And then I get three seconds on me. I get a turnover because, well, let's, let's take a look at that real quick. Let's take a look at 2K's genius AI here. All right, so pick and roll, you know, normal pick and roll here. Old Depot cuts to the basket. He has an open lane. All right, I'm leading the pass. He is wide open. So he can go up for a contested layup. It's not even really that contested. He can get fouled here. What does he do? I don't call for the ball. Immediately passes it to me. He's already going up. That's a decent layup. A foul at best. And... 2K is like, nope, we're going we're gonna to force it to the teammate. Why? Why? What? 
why? One thing I have realized that benefits me with Team Takeover is since I'm doing the Jimmy Butler my career, I know Jimmy's jump shot. So when I control Jimmy, I'll be able to hit shots with him. Like, I just knocked down a corner three with Jimmy Butler. He doesn't even have a good three-pointer. And I just knocked one down in the corner, green release. So since I know his release perfectly, basically, I need to take advantage of that from now on. If Jimmy Butler is open, I got to control him in order to... Oh, my God, Jalen Green just dunked on Jimmy. In order to get some buckets. He's only two for nine, though. Ten-point game for us, the Miami Heat, up by ten. I asked for a close game. I mean... It was close all throughout. Oh, bam, out of bio. That screen worked to perfection. Now the screens are starting to work in the fourth quarter. 12-point lead. They weren't working all game long. Now all of a sudden, they're starting to work. I will take it. Up by 12 now in the fourth. Like I said, this game was close all throughout. At least we're not up by 40. And I'm glad it came against my former team. Look look at my character. I'm zooming in on that. It, it put me in an animation and slowed me down. For no reason. All because I was just slightly off of him. I swear, 2K does that on purpose. They do it. They do this stuff on purpose. Jimmy, and it hits him. And it hits him. All the playmaking badges I have. All the stats I have for playmaking. And I can't throw that pass past KPJ who's not even looking at the ball. Man, I tell you, 2K makes one hell of a video game. Bro, Bam Adebayo has taken over this fourth quarter. He has scored, I believe, eight straight points for the Miami Heat and we are now up 13 the Rockets got as close as five and Jalen Green goes out of bounds a costly turnover for the Houston Rockets three minutes left in this game down 13 they needed that possession and it fails Bam Adebayo is the hot hand so I'm going to try and get it to him unless I can get an easy shot Bam Adebayo take that Bam over KPJ Bam Adebayo with another shot. This man has, what is that, 24 points. He has scored 10 straight points so far in this fourth quarter. So I'm just going to waste out the clock here. We have an 11-point lead. Jimmy Butler comes at the screen. Decent screen. Good screen. Jimmy Butler basically ices it with the minute 20 left. We have a 13-point lead, and that will most likely do it. And with that, I can guarantee you, no one expected one of these teams to score over 100 points. 100, if that. I'm just going to take the shot. Why not? I don't care. 110 points after that abysmal first half. Both teams nearly scored 100. We scored 110. It was a close game throughout. I got my wish. We ended up winning by double digits because Bam at a bio just took over in that fourth quarter. But I got my wish of a close game. Here's the final box score. Gerald Johnson, 42 points, 2 rebounds, 13 assists against his uh, former team. 6 turnovers. A lot of them were just bogus. Uh, 14 for 24 from the field. 2 for 3 from downtown. 12 for 12 from the free throw line. Bam at a bio, man. What a game for him. He started off so slow, but ended with 24 points, 15 rebounds, 5 assists, a steal, and 2 blocks. What, what do you have in that fourth quarter? He had 17. 17 points in that fourth quarter. More than Jimmy and I had combined. That is insane, dude. He had like 10 straight. Jimmy ended up with 18, 4, and 5. Really good game for him. 1 for 2 from 3. I ended up hitting one of those. Uh, Caleb Martin off the bench had 8. Like, we did not have any production besides the big 3, which is usually how it goes. Alexson had 7 off the bench. Lowry had 5. Yurtsevin did his job with the rebound. Anyway, he could not play defense whatsoever. But neither could I, because Kevin Porter Jr. had 25 points on the game on efficient shooting. Uh, he, w he went perfect from twos. Two for eight from downtown. For two pointers, he went perfect. Uh, Porzingis had 20 points and six blocks. He did not get a single block in the second half. This man was a merchant. Chris Middleton got clamped up. That looks like the Chris Middleton I played with. Jalen Green, disappointing, man. I was expecting a showdown against us, but only went three for ten. Old Depot had him on clamp. Same thing, Jabari Smith only attempted four shots but that's gonna be it for me leave a like guys enjoy subscribe guys are new gg